Yeah. Hello, Mr. Miss Ryan, right? No. No. Okay, so how can I help you? TV. Okay, maybe later. Okay, so ah! so in computer we know the binary, right? You know the binary, zero and ones, right? Yeah. What's the fifteen in binary? Uh, you know, if you want to write the one. One, 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 one. Okay. So why binary? Computers are very good at binaries. Okay. They translate. They, that a number one them two two them four eight sixteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good at doubling. Things. So computers translate everything, virtually yeah. everything, to binary. Okay. The pictures. Yeah, they the use, videos. The pictures they use colors. Yeah, yeah, colors. You know the numbers. The numbers are translated to binary because the computers are good at binary. You know the computers are electric. They only yeah. know one and zero. That's right. One and zero because one could be like high voltage, zero could be low voltage because of the circuits. Okay, circuits. So one on one one in binary is fifteen. We know this binary, right? One, well, how come the they one, know, two, how come, four, eight, etc. How come they know electric circuits? No, we design it that way. Okay, we design it that way. This is positive numbers, right? We never talk about storing the negative numbers. Today we want to talk about how the computers store computer. the negative numbers in binary. Yeah, they put a zero in front of it. No. Uh, similar, okay, but not quite. Okay, it's definitely so, to something to do with a zero because yeah. I watched I watch something on the scrap, yeah, by and I think he said something about it. Have you heard of this ABS bit sixteen bit yeah. yeah, and then I watched that video. Yeah, 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 I play the Super Mario, you say the pixel games, right? The da 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 It's when the pixels, one, right? it's when the pixels are bigger. Yeah, but that it's one. When the pixel gets smaller. That one, the, the game is a, actually a computer. The game console is a computer and it uses the ABC CPU, which is a ABC CPU 6502 CPU. Only handles 8 bit at a time. So 8 bit is like you, you have 8 bit here, right? So the computer can handle, can handle one byte a bit this is one a bit right a bit we talk about that is also one byte okay a bit one byte a bit cpu but nowadays the computer this one mommy's computer laptop your computer right even your are 64 bits so it meaning that one cpu now the cpu becomes stronger powerful it, it can handle a byte you know a byte at the same time okay in one go, okay, you can load it. So when I said uh, handle, basically you can think of it this way: you can load this, load the one byte. Uh, you know, but if it's eight bit, load how one much byte is one at the time. Sorry. How much is one byte? Eight bit. Eight bit. No, okay. but what is it like? Does it do? What does the byte do? A byte, eight bit, storing the number. So we talk about the bit, bit zero one, well, and eight bit is from. What is uh, what is uh, what do you measure with bytes? You mean how many numbers can it store, represent? Now I'm saying, what does it, how would the bytes measure? Like, like in what, like, um, let's do like, like scenario that the, the units is bytes. Byte measure, the unit. Yeah. The, the unit, the byte is also is a unit. It's the data yeah, what, size. What do you measure with bytes? For example, you measure like um, things with. For example, you measure uh, like that sort of like liquid with liters or. Uh, ah, the liquid. Right. A byte is a bit, yeah. I know, I know, I know. I'm saying like, what do you measure with it? Says it, no. For example, you probably um. For example, you, that's not nice. You measure like um objects, like uh, like you small, like use kilograms to measure your weight. And you know, keep quiet. And you just use different uh units for different uh measurements. Different measurements. The byte already a measurement. Yeah, but what is the measurement for? I already okay, know. measurement for okay yeah. for the size. The, uh, the oh, okay. oh. How big is the picture? How how much uh, memory do we need to store a picture on the so, hard disk? Yeah, what do you like? 
like what what was a bite flying measure? Size. Size of what? I size of storage. Like every unit like measures like size or amount. Size of storage in memory or in hard disk. Okay? What? These are persistent data. You, you have computer, right? You type in something. And let's going to go into this. So you switch off the computer, you turn it on, you can still read your Yes, like data. this is like the answer I wanted. Okay, I don't good. really understand why you just like take too long, for example. Yeah, okay. I just I... wanted like for for example, uh pencil centimeters sound D B or Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. What's D B to measure sound? How loud is not Dice uh I uh brown? Yeah. DB. Okay, I don't know. Okay. Okay. I was saying that. Like, okay. So one one bit represent two values, zero and one. A bit, a bit is one byte represents from zero to two hundred fifty five, right? Okay. Let's take a look at this a bit. Okay. Then all the rest are similar. Okay. A bit computer. For example, we're talking about the Super Mario gaming console. The a bit ones. The, the, the pixels Superman. are bigger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that you one. can't really see much. Yeah, okay. You could see, it's just not very detailed. Yeah, not very detailed. I mean, nothing compared to nowadays you play the Nintendo Switch. That one is 64 bit, okay? The CPU is eight times, at least eight times powerful than the one. What do you mean yeah. at least eight times? Eight because 64. 64 bit, that's what I'm saying. The computer but why can blow the 64 bit. Why at least? It could why? be eight times nine, 72. Let's, let's eight more. Okay, what I was saying, okay? Not, 8 bit it's just one CPU. Nowadays, the CPU, the computers, has multiple cores. So instead of one single brand, it has like eight, yeah. eight brands. Yeah, no, that's, that's what I'm you said saying. That at least. Least. So it could be eight times. Yeah, yeah. So it could, it, it could be eight, nine, nine. Oh, okay, seven. okay. But you don't understand what no, I'm saying. No, but it, it doesn't make any sense. That so sense. if if it doesn't we, make any sense. Okay. <laughs> Which part doesn't make any sense? Your language. Okay, okay, maybe you can teach me, educate me, okay? Yeah, but you forget. Well, write it down, teach me, okay? So I don't forget. Yeah, but you won't. No, you use forget it. the notes. Let's come back to this, please. You so, never do that. So. You never go back, you never go back. 8 bits, right? 8 bits, 1 by is from 0 to 255, right? We know that, right? Yeah. But this is for the positive integer, but in computers. Computers know how to add two numbers. How about subtract? We don't want to design the computer in a complex way. Yeah, but what's the 0 to 255 for? The size, it can represent. A bit, it can represent from value from 0 to 255. Represent? Sorry? What do you mean by represent? Okay, for A bit, the 0 is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. This is 0. Okay? This is 0. 1. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. This is 1. 15. 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, yeah, 1, 1, 1. What's the number for? Huh? What's the number for? This is the decimal we're using today. This is, if we want to... I, I, I know, I know, I'm not asking what the number is. I'm saying, what is it used for? It's like for picture and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is for the picture. The storing the numbers. Everything in yeah, computer. Yeah, what's the numbers for? The numbers. So suppose. Yeah, I know, I know. What's the numbers for? Storing everything. Computers. The the programming. Your Python code. Yeah, what's your the picture. Your what's voice. The, what's the difference between zero and one? I'm literally asking a question, but you. Okay, you, so can you, you say something else which isn't the answer to my question? Okay, can you say it again, please? I say, like you know the numbers. What are they for? For what are they for? Yeah. Like, well, like how are they a used? A shoe is for to you to wear. Like, like how are they used? We, if we want to store the data in computer, we store them as numbers, the values. Everything is digits. So your picture is essentially zero one 1 picture, right? Picture is the value, the color. Color, RGB, red, green, blue, but different what, portions. What if it's already reached with the max? For 255. Then we can use two bytes, more bytes to represent. That's a you good got question. Like five gigabytes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, what? You huh? say, so if it reaches 255, yeah. then you're saying, oh, we're getting more gigabytes. So. That's what you said. Okay, so listen. So th this one byte, right? The size. Mm -hmm. Represent from 0 to 255. Yeah, I know. And if we want to represent 0 to 256, then we have to use two bytes. 
So it doesn't like add. What if it goes like as an over to 250, 255? So um, those numbers, what if they add over 255? Good question. Okay, if two numbers added up more than 250, what happened, right? Because this, when you say good question, it's likely to say that you don't know the answer. Okay, so is that true? Like, can I rephrase it this way? Like, if two numbers, you know, the computer, CPU, uh, has instructions, right? Like, load the one number from one register, uh, which is the one number, A. Load A, okay? And load B, if we're talking about A bit, okay? And then add. A plus B, okay? Right? And if this A plus B is more than 255, what happened, right? Yeah. Then you'll be overflow. We say overflow. I, I tell you next, but that's a very good then question. How come if it's just over one, uh, over 255, and then you said you use it to gigabyte? But how no, no, no. If it's it is A plus B, two numbers, then, then it will overflow. It doesn't make any sense. No, it depends on how you're going to handle this, right? In, for example, in a big game, a big Super Mario game, you got a score, right? The number of the the lives in Super Mario, right? Yeah. It's up to ninety nine, right? On the screen, there's only two digit ninety nine. The maximum you can represent to ninety nine, right? Yeah. Ninety nine is smaller than two hundred. It can be represent using one byte. That's yeah. not answering my question. No. <laughs> So you know how a if it's a plus b over two hundred fifty five, mm -hmm. yeah, then it will overflow. That's what you said, and then it depends on how you handle it. Yes, but in general, it will be overflow for a bit. Yeah, 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 that's that's what you said. Yeah, and and apparently, if it's over one num if if it's over two hundred fifty five, there's only one number. Then apparently, you will use two gigabytes. Two gigabytes. I didn't say that. Why didn't say that? No, that's what you said. Two gigabytes. Yeah, that's what you said. No, I didn't say that. You didn't say that. No, I didn't say that. No, I, when I asked the first, the, okay. first, the question, like before, when I asked, oh, uh, what happens if it's like if two numbers like add up over two hundred fifty-six? You said that we can use another byte to represent. Yeah. Yeah. All we dis. That's, yeah, that's all, what you said. all. Yeah, yeah. All we discuss. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. no, no. So interrupt. Okay. Me. So this is what. You, so I. So you, first of all, you said that. Oh, if it's over 255, then like 256, and then you like, oh, you use like 2 gigabytes. 2 bytes, not 2 gigabytes, okay? I'm, I see this confusing. No, that my question's hard, it's just that you don't understand what my question means. <laughs> At this point, do you understand this uh, 0 to 250 for 8 bits? Yeah? Yeah, the last one is 8 bits, it's 1111, 1111, this is 255. Okay? It doesn't really make sense to me. Which part? Do you understand this bit? All of it. Which part you don't understand and I can explain but because you just keep saying you don't understand. I don't understand which part you don't understand. It's just that um If you say all of it I can restart, no problem. Do you understand this if bit? If you do it all again exactly, then then Yeah then, then won't get Yeah anywhere. of course I do. I of course I do that. I do scratch. Yeah, you do you understand this bit? Yeah, I do scratch, so I do okay. it. This is 255, so if we use the A bit to store a positive number, the, there are 256 possibilities from 0 to 255, am I right? If uh, we use this to store all the positive numbers. Okay. This is math, nothing to do with computer, just math, binary. It's something to do with computers. Binary, because binary. No, because if you look at those numbers, what are they for? That's, the numbers are something to do with computers. That's no, this is binary, max. No, 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 but number number right. We're in the, in the, yeah, those are to do with This computer. is decimal numbers, the yeah, number we use. Yeah, that, yeah. Uh, before, I asked, what are those numbers for? You said, you said something, no, oh, it's for like, oh, like, if you have a picture, and, that, and that's to do with computers. Okay, okay, but we can look at it just in pure math, the values. No, this no, is decimal, no, this no, is binary. Something to do with, and also, where did you learn this from? I learned this from a book. I read a book. I yeah. learned it. Good question. Yeah, because, well, because, because um, if it was from a book, then then probably um, the, okay. you are teaching it differently from a book. Okay, okay. Uh, so, okay, well, let's come back to this. Okay, so, so the thing now here is that these are positive numbers. 
Right? But for computers, we don't want to store all positive numbers. We want to store the negative numbers. Why? That's a good question. Because, <laughs> because the computer knows how to do this addition, right? For example, like 1101 plus 0101. Okay? The computer knows how to do the addition. 1 plus 1 equals 0. Carry on 1. 1 plus 0 plus 0 equals 1. 1 plus 1 equals 0. Carry on 1. 1 plus 1 equals 0. And carry on 1. Okay? Yeah? This is addition. Computers, the, the CPU knows how to do this very efficiently, right? Loading the value from one register, loading the value from another register, end it up and put it back, okay? This is what the computers do. But how about the subtraction? Subtract is difficult. We don't want to, we want, we don't want to come up with separate yeah, unit for computer to do this subtraction. But, but, um, so when you do addition, it's like adding, um, adding another like picture or something. No, just math. If we want to ask yeah, the computer yeah, yeah, to do... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, do. no, no. I, you're just saying it's math. It's math. It's yeah. math. Huh? But I'm saying, like, what is it used for? Um, because it has to be to do something with computers. And I thought, oh, maybe the, um, the unit was 0 to 255 yeah. is something to do with that. Yeah, so um, if you subtract, then it's probably... Then it probably means like deleting something. But then if you delete something, then you get give a let, like um the, the computer doesn't need to remember all the the computer can remember less things. And you're saying that the computer knows how to add, and you're saying that the computer knows how to add, and it's very easy for a computer to add. But why why would it like um I. S we had to subtract because it just delete basically what I think. No, no, it's not the same. It's reverse, yeah. But yeah, but yeah, yeah. But get, getting an image is like okay. the reverse is deleting it. So okay, but it, how? Okay, so for example, like one 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 zero one. If we want to ask computer to to, to delete subtract one zero one one. Yeah, we can do this. Eh? One plus one. 1 minus 1 is 0. 0 minus 1, 0 is not enough. We need to borrow 1 from, from there, right? We can do this, follow this procedure, but it's it's not the same. It's not the same. It's different procedure, right? Yeah, but, but, so, but borrowing 1 from the left is from the, the, the value that is higher. I know that is like, I think what you're saying is like about the, about the boring, borrowing, yeah. but it's but how come it, it doesn't know how to borrow when it knows how to add, uh, put a carry? Okay, okay. Very good. This is very good. What I'm saying is that the add and subtract is different. This one is borrow. This one is carry on. Yes, sure, it's possible. We can design a separate unit for computer to say, okay, if it's a subtraction, we use this kind of logic. If it's addition, we use this kind of logic. Then, then why? Then, okay. then how come it already knows how to add? That because we, we to add the, the to design the circuit, right? so computer circuits, the, the board is simpler. To add, this is more complicated. We don't want to introduce actual complexity. Okay, so tell. Yeah, but then, then we get um, more technology. Yeah, I know, but so nowadays, these two things can be merged because we design a very clever way to put this, transform this to. To addition okay so for example 10 minus 5 is it the same as 10 plus minus 5 right yeah I know. yeah similarly okay yeah. with that in mind so we just have to design a way to store the negative number so instead of all the positive numbers from 0 to 255 let's say let's say we use the left bit okay so this is the leftmost bit which is called most significant bit msb most yeah, significant how do you, bit. Listen, how listen. do you use column method to add a negative number? That's magic. A very, very good. That's magic. It's not okay. magic. It's just you're always talking okay. about math. Okay. Look, hmm. that's what I'm saying. The most significant bit. No, you were saying it was about math. You were can, saying it's can, about magic, and and then I said you weren't saying. About okay. Magic. Can you, you please listen? Up, otherwise, this and lesson math. will never, never end. Okay. But then you said, oh, that's why I was talking about. But you actually won. You're talking about magic, not Why math. Can you please? <laughs> okay.
It was just that when I ask a question, it gives so much problems. <laughs> because you ask lots of the interesting questions. No, because it's not that like. Not only understand. it might be hard. It's just it's just that you um. Okay. You can't be it's just it's just that like sometimes you don't understand and give me a different answer to not. Has seen before looks like a rabbit. We want to store the negative numbers using the a a yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, but before I asked, how do you add negative numbers in column and method? But you column method. Column method. But you didn't even answer that. I'm I'm you trying know. to explain. I I, I need I to. I already explain. know that part. Okay, so <laughs> the most significant bit. Let's just are say. You sure, are you come sure? Come on. I, are you sure you're trying to answer? Because I already, if I ask the question, then I already knew that part. Which part? Okay, so. No, you're talking about 10 minus 5 equals 10 minus okay, 5. Okay, so. So, but, but maybe that's a little cute because, um, because I already knew that part. I just, I, I just asked, like, in column method, that sort of stuff. And now you don't even understand what is column method. What's column method? That, no that, that way, that way. Do you want to explain it? Yeah, column method, for example, um, uh, 26 and uh, 45 and then and then you just do column method one um yeah it's mainly sorry um, seven and and there's also column subtraction it's just, um, it's just column method yeah yeah okay yeah, yeah, it's, it's the same it's the same method to add numbers is called column method yeah yeah, yeah. the thing is but you didn't understand what oh. column method is yeah, oh, okay i, I didn't understand what column method is <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let me repeat, okay, please, we are making very slow progress here, okay? Yeah, that's a good reason for that. This is column method. So, the problem here is that the subtraction is a different type of logic, different type of process. We want to merge it in computer, we want to simplify this, okay? So, instead of the subtraction, we want to be able to do it, perform it just like addition. So, here, we use a bit to store positive number there to, from 0 to 255, okay? So we want to inject to be able to represent the negative numbers as well. So let's say we take the leftmost bit, which is most significant bit. If it's 0, we say it's a positive number. If it's 1, we say it's a negative number, okay? So in this case, we lose one bit. So we have seven bits left. Seven bits we can represent from 0 to 127, right? This is the range, okay? So the negative numbers is slightly different. For positive number, you know, just just represent the way it is, right? For negative number, here is the thing. So if you want to st uh, store minus five, how do we represent it in binary? Here is the thing, this, this is the key thing today, okay? I tell you why. Minus five, let's say can't we take a five. Can't you do zero five? No, we want to store minus five. So let's consider the five, the positive version. You okay? just subtract. Uh, no, no. Can't you no, just do like, if that put is, something that you can't it, write, it, and then use that for the negative symbol? What you need to do is, for example, if you could add five, um, whatever, like n or something, and then you just subtract n times two. So then this. No, it doesn't work like that. Okay, so no, this. So you put, can't you just put? Can I? You can only, I? Can, since you only use zero and one a, for it. So why can't you just put a 2 in front of it to show it's a negative number? That's how you no, no, this is... That's because how you it with operations. Yeah, everything is 0 and 1. Okay, so that what, let me finish how computer store the number negative 5, okay? So we store the 5 first. What's 5? We know if 5 is 101, right? Yeah? 101. Is it 101? We, we prefix with leading zeros. Uh, 101. One, yeah, 101. Is it 101? One, two, four. Four plus one. This is five, right? Positive um, number five. For negative number, we invert everything, which is yeah, but then you can one, 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 ze one, zero, one, zero. Okay? Yeah, but you can have like millions of zeros. That's right. A bit. That's what I'm saying. For single byte. For a bit byte. For sixteen bit is a byte. Okay? Yeah, but that, um... There will be a limited yeah. number of leading zeros, okay? For byte, okay? But Do you understand this bit? Because that negative 5, because that number, one, 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 that, that number in red, that could already be a number, which is negative 5. Which is negative 5. No, no, it doesn't work that way. Okay, so what, what are we doing? This is 5. We invert it, right? 
And there's one more in operation. We need to add one, plus one here. Okay? So this, one, 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 zero, one, one. This is the computer representation of minus one. Yeah, but isn't that already a number? This is a number. Yeah, but yeah, but before the negative thing in bubble B was already uh, was um was added. Um, isn't that already a number in red? Apart from negative. Yeah, it's, but it's not minus five. I need to add one to make it minus five. Listen, why? Why? The leftmost bit is the the sign, right? One for minus negative, zero for positive, right? Yeah? Mm -hmm. So this is minus five, this is five, right? Yeah? Mm -hmm. If we add it together, what do we get? One. What do we get? One. This is zero, carry one. This is zero, carry one, this is zero, carry one, zero, 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 zero. We have actual one. And this is overflow, right? Because this is eight bit, right? We don't care what happened here. This is throw away. So Minus 5 plus 5 is 0. Do you see how this works? Why? No, 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 but that's not really overflow. It's just, it, that's not overflow. I thought you meant by overflow it means like the, um, the computer crashing. No, 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 no. But that's what I thought you meant by overflow, but... That's no, not computer not crashing. This is intended over, behavior. But, that, but that's not overflow. That's just... That's just like... That's just uh, all you just cares about. If we want to do the subtraction, we can just add it, right? For example, 5 minus 5 is just adding this. So, one logic. Does it make sense? In order for this to work, we need to store the negative number using this way. Yeah? Minus 5, we do the yeah, 5 why, why inverted you... plus 1. Why? This is a good question. Why? Because because now we, we, we want to achieve the subtraction using the addition, right? Using the addition. This is using the addition. We just add it up together and then it give, gives us. This is called tools. Tools complement. Okay? This is method it's called tools complement. That, nowadays, negative, negative numbers are stored in computer like that. Okay? Remember, take the positive half, invert every digit plus one. Okay, so let's consider this a bit. This a bit. The the range is represent instead of from zero to two hundred fifty five. It's now from one hundred twenty eight minus one hundred twenty eight to one hundred twenty seven. Okay, we store one more negative number than the positive number. Okay, zero in binary is just all zero, right? How about my minus zero? Okay, so zero there's only one representation. Right? Zero is this one. How about minus zero? What's minus zero? Just zero. Yes, minus zero, but if you use using this, to complement. Minus zero, so it's zero inverted. Inverted, right? This is zero inverted. So one, 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 yeah, one, one, yeah, one, one, one. And plus one, then you become one followed by eight zeros. And then we discard the first uh, leftmost one, okay? So there's only one representation of zero, okay? Does it make sense now? Scary monster. So I I was just saying that now the A bit yeah. represent minus one hundred twenty eight to one hundred twenty seven. Okay. Why? Why? That's you a good. Even, you didn't even. Because it. because yeah. from zero to one hundred twenty seven is is I'm this bit right? Out. Yeah, zero to one hundred twenty seven. You know right? So the leftmost bit is zero, and then this is zero 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 to one 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 one. This is from. 0 to 127, right? Yeah? Here, if this is 1, if this is 1, this is 1, and then here from uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. Here, this is uh, minus, 100, uh, minus 120, minus 128 to minus 1, okay? So there's one more um, negative number. 7 bits represent from 0 to, to 127. This is the range for 7 bits. So to sum up, yeah, we talk about this tools complement. Tools complement, this is the way for computer to store the negative numbers. For positive numbers, we just store the way it is. The leftmost bit, the leftmost bit, if it's 0, it's positive. If it's 1, it's negative. Why we store it like that? Because we want to perform the subtraction as an addition, as, a, as we see here, right? You know, minus 5, plus 5, you know, it works perfect using this method.
Mm, so tough. So tough. Okay, so can you explain to me why the computer needs to store the negative number using because, this the tool's because, complement? Because for some reason people want to um, can do subtraction. Yeah, using the same logic, right? Okay, so you what? Make it negative. Yeah, so how do you store the negative 15 in computer? Right? One question, if you know. 15, how do we store the negative 15? What's the positive 15? What's the positive 15? One, 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 one. Okay, so we invert it. Invert it to become one, 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 zero, 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 zero. One. And then we put the one here. Okay, and this is the 15 in computers. The leftmost bit is the sign. Zero for positive number, one for negative number. There is yeah, no there is no minus yeah, zero, okay? There is yeah, only but, positive um, zero. Isn't this, Kanye, like, isn't this like already a number? This is the number, yes. This yeah, is. yeah, but apart from negative 15, isn't this already a number? Okay, good question. I now see your point. Okay, now see your point. Computers, the data, we can interpret the data the way we, we want it, right? If we say we don't want the negative number, then this represents a different positive number, right? Okay, yeah? Does it answer your question? Mm -hmm. so yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's no conflict. Right? It depends on how you want to interpret this. What I'm saying is that if we want to uh, store the negative numbers, then this is the way. The decimal speed is the sign. But you say, okay, I don't care about negative number. This type is unsigned, unsigned integer, AP integer, in AP integer. Then there's no sign bit. Every bit is positive number. So this number is different. This number is some, I don't know what's this number. It's positive, right? Okay. This is A bit, yeah? For 64 bit computers like this one and mommy's computer or your computers is yeah, you can handle like a bytes at the same time a bytes at the same time okay you can load this number you know a byte a bytes could be very big okay yeah but uh when did uh they add the negative numbers when did they add the negative numbers so you can declare it you know when you do the programming yeah i'm saying when when did yeah when did it add a negative number yeah depends on if you want to add a negative number no 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 saying like like when like can i add a negative number i'm saying like when did it like you're saying oh you think that it, before you can uh subtract but then you said oh people came up with a very smart idea yeah but, that yeah, but when was that? That's what I'm asking. When? Uh, yeah. Very good. That you can search and tell so me who know. invented the computer. Who invented the computer? Some I think a guy named Tom something invented. I don't the know light the, light the guy. Uh, Tom something invented the light. Okay, light. when was the first computer? Nineteen uh, forty something. I don't. I don't know, but I know. When you can learn the history of. I computer. don't know, but I know when the first light was. Yeah, we humans are very smart, okay? We humans are very smart. Not everyone. Seriously, the computer is so complicated. So complicated. How the computer works? So complicated. Just we wouldn't be know, knowing that, right? You see? We humans have yeah, very smart brain. Yeah, yeah, but but they have like, um, animals have like, uh, like, um, they, but they just have like, uh, uh, they have like claws and talons or shells, that sort of stuff. Or, and they have adapted to their environment. That's oh. right, yeah. Evolution, right? Evolution. For example, um, for example cats, uh, I think they have this sort of, um, they, grow, they, uh, they, they grow much faster than we do. And also... Yeah, but and, that's not... You see? And also they have this like... I lived, That's that, right, yeah. That, yeah. You for a species to survive, you have to got something that's keep you survive, right? For Evolution, example, right? For the animals like cat. They actually they are very good at outside like, in, in the wide world. They run very fast, they can catch the birds, everything, right? But humans, you know, the human I told you like babies, humans are so dumb, right? I, I, thought you, I thought you said people were so smart. I you said no, no, no. Yeah. The babies. <laughs> what I'm saying, babies. Babies need the care, right? When you're born, before two years old, you, you know nothing. 
You're crying, you see? Just crying, crying. You know how to drink cry. Them. You yeah. know how to drink. That's evolution, right? Those babies, that's not, that's not, those babies who don't that, cry, they not, die. Okay? You see? That's, that's evolution. That's not That's not evolution. Evolu Adaptation, right? It, because evolution is like a longer period. It's like yeah. maybe like thousands or... That's right, yes. And those good pieces, better, stronger pieces, yeah? They survive, they pass it's, their it's, genes to their no, offspring. That's, that's not evolution, that's adaptation. Okay, okay. For example, uh, like um, camels, they have like uh, those like humps for like fat and eyelashes. Mm, the water. I, I, the water. Eyelashes for tequila sand mm. and heels too, so they don't sink in the sand. Yeah, they have two bumps on their back to store the water. Yeah. If there's one, you know, I would assume that those are the camels which only one. Spam doesn't store enough water, they die, they, so they don't pass their genes yeah, to their offspring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for example, cactuses, mm. they, ha they have spikes to protect um, themselves. Shush, yes. Uh, <laughs> and they have. Okay, okay. they have water, and, and their inside is like. Uh, has a uh, very uh, watery, that's all, if you call that word. And, and since they live in a desert, a lot, of, a lot of animals want to eat cactus, so they adapted to have spikes. But then camels have adapted to have jaws which can eat through the spikes. Okay, yeah, okay, good, good. Okay, why are we talking about evolution and adaptation? <laughs> because, you, because you literally said, oh, uh, people have adapted to make these computers and that sort of stuff. Yeah. Babies! And, and, next. And, and, and then you're like, cat, Chelsea doesn't know how to do this sort of stuff and then and then and i started talking about the the like it has, can be other stuff and then we start to talk about adaptation and that stuff. okay good good okay okay that's it for today bye bye six minutes bye bye good job bye bye